Welcome to Info Plus. The lost submarine's wreckage has been found in the ocean. The location of the people who were inside it, however, is missing. Did something in the sea try to hurt them? What have the United States and European governments said about this? Other individuals have died in addition to Prince David and his son. Today, we'll try to give you the most recent information about the lost submarine in the ocean. So make sure to watch the video all the way through. There has been very important news about the lost submarine. Everyone is in awe of the underwater scientists who swam to the sea's depths. Experts say that by now, all of the oxygen in the submarine would have been used up, and there is no chance for anyone to live. It means that the individuals inside the submarine have all died a terrible death. Where did the five individuals, including Prince David, go? Is still the question. Captain Jamie Frederick of the American Coast Guard said in a statement yesterday that you sometimes find yourself in a situation where you have to make difficult choices, but we haven't reached that point yet. He said that this is a task to save people and that it will be done to the letter. The Royal Navy, the Canadian Air Force, and Coast Guard ships all took part in this mission. On Tuesday, emergency workers heard sounds, but the nature of those sounds is still unknown. Professor Bill Manson of the U.S. Navy said that a person loses consciousness if they don't get oxygen for more than five minutes, and if they don't get oxygen for more than 10 minutes, they die. On Sunday, communication with the Titanic submarine stopped one hour and 45 minutes after the trip from Ocean Gate had begun. About 400 miles under the sea near Street Johns, Newfoundland, Canada, is where the Titanic is going. There are three people in the Titanic submarine, including the pilot and CO. Two of the passengers are British citizens who were born in Pakistan. A tourist trip costs $1.5 million, and a group called Ocean Gate Expeditions takes tourists to see the wreckage of the Titanic in the depths of the sea. The search for the lost submarine Titanic in the ocean is still going on after four days, according to the most recent information. During the search, debris from the area around the Titanic was found. Experts are worried that the Titanic, a submarine named after the ship, might not have been able to handle the pressure of the ocean water and might have burst. The debris found is from the same submarine that was going to show guests the Titanic. At the moment, nothing can be said with certainty about it. With this success, it's also important to remember that the area around the Titanic submarine wreckage is filled with debris from the ocean floor. According to figures from the U.S. Coast Guard, the submarine Titanic's five passengers would have run out of oxygen at 4.18 a.m. Pakistan time yesterday. It means that the people inside haven't had oxygen since yesterday, and it is not possible for people to live for so many hours without oxygen. According to the sea search team looking for the lost Titanic submarine, they heard signals coming from where it was. Every half hour on Tuesday, the rescue workers heard signals. The search for the submarine used more tools, and signals were still being picked up. American officials say that they are sending out more ships and boats to speed up the search for the lost submarine that has been missing for four days. Let me tell you about the Ocean Gate abode, which is a boat that works on the sea surface near Ocean Gate. It talks to the Polar Prince all the time. 45 minutes after leaving the Polar Prince, communication between the Polar Prince and the Titan was cut off. The Titan is also run by the same ship. The communication between the Polar Prince and the Titan can be seen as a thread of breath. The Titan is a tourist ship that takes people who want to see what happened to the Titanic after it hit an iceberg in the ocean and sank in 1912. The Titanic wasn't just a ship that was falling. It was also the owner's pride and joy. Before its first trip, the owner said, I have built a ship that not even God can sink. But the ship did not hit a rock. Instead, it was hit by an iceberg, which tore it apart. Today, this ship goes out to sea to send a message. Some people go to see the ruins of the Titanic, while others want to see the heaven of intensity. The Titanic abode has been set up for these kinds of people. It is 21 feet long and the price of a ticket is $1.5 million, which is the same as 100 million rupees. From the shore, it takes less than three hours to get to the Titanic. Tourists stay there for about two and a half hours, take pictures, get water samples, and touch the Titanic's stern from the abode. After that, they head back to the ship. A one-of-a-kind abode, the Titan is.
On June 18, it set sail with five guests, including Prince David, a 48-year-old prince from Pakistan, and Salman David, his 19-year-old son. Paul Henry Nargolite and Hemsh Harding are both members of this club, which works on science innovations around the world. Ocean Gate CEO Stackton Roche is part of the group that is putting on this fun event. After communication with the abode stopped, the search for it began. It had enough oxygen for 96 hours. The search for the lost abode in the ocean by American and Canadian ships and spacecraft continued. In the same way that a ship goes missing, a 20,000 square kilometer area was searched to find the lost abode in the Malaysian Sea. This abode was not found though. The Bermuda Triangle is in the same ocean, which is another important fact. Strange things happen to ships that pass over or are close to it. Similar to what happened with the Titanic, the truth about this Bermuda Triangle has not yet been reached. It's not clear yet. The Titanic is hurt and at the bottom of the sea. It has moved 1,500 kilometers away from where it was when it sank. It sank, taking 1,500 passengers with it. Their bodies have never been found. Could their souls be lost at sea? Is this the work of something out of this world? No one has found the answers to these questions yet. The lost abode has been the subject of many theories and worries. The entire world is working to find it because the lives of its passengers are more important than their abode. No one would care if the abode went missing except its owner. But everyone is looking up for the safety of the passengers. Many people's eyes are filled with tears. Robots are also being used along with the resources of the big powers. In order to avoid another incident like the Greek shipwreck, such means should be used to stop people from being smuggled and to capture the animals that are illegally killing people in Europe. In the comments, please tell us what you think about this helpful video.